Hey guys, good evening and welcome back again to your Unacademy Neat English channel. I hope all of you are doing great and having a good time. So my dear students, as you know, I keep on coming with such sessions which keeps on motivating you all the time, right? Even this particular session, which I'm going to take now, it is absolutely going to motivate you for sure, number one. In this particular session, I'm going to give you a proper strategy for the NEET 2024 examination to be cracked with a very high score, right? And this particular session is particularly for the ones who have just got serious about their preparation, right? So my dear students, I'm sure there must be a lot of questions right now in your head, right? And what all questions which you must be having in your mind right now I have noted down all the questions over here. Yes. The first and the most important question, which I'm sure majority of the students will be having right now. What is that? What is going to be the difficulty level of the NEET 2024 examination? Is it going to be easy? Is it going to be moderate? Is it going to, is it going to be hard? Number one. Number two, if we start the preparation now, if we get into the serious mode now, can we cross 680 mark? This will be the second important question. If it is possible to get into the dream college, if we get serious now, if we start the preparation now, then what should be the strategy ahead, right? What all things we should do? The third question. The fourth question, what should be the source of the lectures for the detailed study, right? This is one more question. How many mock tests we need to write for this particular examination to be cracked with a good score? This is one more question, right? Avenger 3.0 batch details, I'm sure about that. And what all chapters you should focus more, right? These are, I believe all these questions will be right now in your mind. Let me answer all, all these questions one by one, my dear students. Okay, the first question which you are seeing over here, that is the difficulty level of the NEET 2024 examination. My dear students, first of all, as per your recent NMC guidelines, there are almost 8 to 10 easy kill chapters which have been deleted. I use the term easy kill chapters. Almost 10 chapters have been deleted. 10 chapters almost have been deleted. And all these chapters were basically your easy kill chapters. What is meant by easy kill chapters? My dear students, from these 10 chapters, you used to get 10 questions basically. And these 10 questions were used to be of very, very, very low standard, right? Because all these 10 chapters, almost, almost all these 10 chapters, if the question used to come from these chapters, the question directly used to come from the NCRT, right? So whenever you used to get your neat paper in the examination hall, right? The first 10 minutes, I'm sure every one of you, right? You'll be going through the questions in the first 10 minutes of the, of the paper. And in those 10 minutes, my dear students, there are almost like 10 to 20 questions which a student does at that point itself. And these were the 10 questions, which used to be easy kill questions, right? Which student used to do in those first 10 minutes only without doing, without using pen and paper also, because they used to be majority of the times from the NCRT directly a line used to be copy pasted from the NCRT and the question was easy kill. Now, my dear students, these 10 questions, as you almost be doing these 10 questions now will be distributed to the other chapters, right? Now, what are the chapters exactly? What are the chapters? These 10 questions are going to be distributed in the other chapters. What does that mean? The other chapters like the big chapters, like your thermodynamics, like the hydrocarbons, like the chemical bonding, like the electrochemistry. So till now, for example, from electrochemistry, you used to get the two questions. Now, now, now the chances are you will be getting three to four questions from electrochemistry. The chances are you will be getting like three to four questions from thermodynamics. The chances are you'll be getting three to four questions from equilibrium. And my dear students, as I keep on telling you, these are the chapters, this thermo, equilibrium, right, electro, these were the chapters which majority of the students used to focus less on, right? These used to be the chapters which students, majority of the students, they used to leave these chapters, right? Now, my dear students, you cannot leave these chapters. So let me keep it very short and precise. Now in the NEET 2024 examination, more questions will be asked from the difficult chapters, right? Let me keep it very simple. More questions will be asked from the difficult chapters. Now you have to do 
the detailed study of all the chapters. Perfect. So keep one thing in mind. Definitely the level of your NEET 2024 examination is going to be, is going to be comparatively higher than that of your NEET 2022 or even 2023. Definitely it's going to be higher. Because more questions are going to come from the, from the, from the, from the hard chapters basically. Perfect. Now my dear students, the second thing, the second thing, which chapters, which topics to focus more? This is again one important point. Let me give you some high weighted chapters first of all, from which more questions will come and exactly the topics from a particular chapter which you have to focus more on. Look at this my dear students, look at this. This is one of the high weighted chapter, electrochemistry, thermodynamics. In electrochemistry, in electrochemistry you can expect some three questions. In thermodynamics, you can expect three to four questions. And these are the topics, my dear students, which you have to focus more on. You cannot leave these topics at any cost. You cannot just thoroughly read these topics. No, you have to do the in-depth study of these particular topics, my dear students. As you can see, Nernest equation, conductance, cold ross law, thermodynamic processes, entropy, heat of reaction, gives free energy, right? In the similar way, look at the other chapters, other high weighted chapters from equilibrium. KPKC calculation, super important. Lee Chatelier principle, super important. pH calculation, solubility product. Three to four questions from this chapter as well. And similarly, if you talk about kinetics, kinetics, two to three questions for sure will come, right? Zero order, first order, Arrhenius equation. These are the short, short topics which you are not going to leave. Not only leave, my dear students, you have to do the in depth study of these particular topics. Solution, ideal, non ideal solution, colligative properties, right? In the similar way, look at the other chapters. Chemical bonding, chemical bonding. My dear students, three to four questions you can expect from chemical bond. Three to four questions, right? And from which topics exactly? VSCPR, valence shell electron pair repulsion, hybridization, molecular orbital theory, as well as bond parameters. Coordination chemistry, three super important topics you have to focus on more. VBT, CFT, isomerism. General organic chemistry, again, resonance, hyperconjugation, aromaticity, carbocation, and carbene instability, right? Similarly, from alcohols, Look at these particular dehydration and leucose test, right? Similarly, if I talk about particularly the reaction part, SN1 reactions, SN2 reactions, E1, E2 reactions, diazotization, coupling, aldol, canizaro, clazen, side chain oxidation, and acidic strength of carboxylic acids, and basic strength of amines. These are going to be the short, short topics in your reaction part as well, right? And my dear students, if you talk about the DNF block elements, DNF block elements do not skip these three topics at all. One is your KMNO4, K2, CR2, so in compounds, their preparation properties, right, and lanthanoid contraction. So, these are the high weightage chapters now in your chemistry. High weightage chapters from which three to four questions for sure are going to come, and these questions will come from these topics only. So, my dear students, do these topics on high priority in the detailed format, right? All the question patterns should be done over here in these chapters. Okay? Now, if you are the beginner, if you have just now got serious for your preparation, if you just now got serious for your preparation, if your preparation is not up to the mark, is it really possible to score a very good rank in the NEET 2024 if you start your preparation now? My dear students, let me tell you the answer is a big yes. You can do it. People have done it, my dear students. I have, I can make you meet a lot of my ex-students who studied in the last four or five months and scored a very, very, very good rank in the NEET examination, even in the JE examination. So the answer is a big yes, you can do it. You can do it. It's not impossible. If you just remain consistent, if you just remain consistent, if you remain focused, if you have your goal in front of you all the time, the answer is a big yes, you are going to get in your dream college for sure. And you can do it. You can do it. You can do it, my dear students. It is just, it needs consistency. It needs hard work. It needs effort, which you have to put in. That too for like six months. That's all. Imagine after six months, imagine yourself in that white coat. You can do it. That's why I'm telling you. You can do it. Now, my people, what exactly should be the 200 days? Almost some 200 days are left till your examination. What should be the strategy ahead? If you are thinking it's not possible, I am telling you, I'm giving you in writing. If you follow the points which I'm going to tell you, Dear students, you are going to enter into the dream college for sure. 
hundred percent. I'm giving you in this in writing. I'm telling you again and again. So first of all, first of all, no doubt the time is very less, right? But it's not too less. The time is less, but it's not too less. You have got ample amount of time to crack it, right? It is just, it is just eight plus hours of self study is needed. Not only on one day, not only for one week, for complete six seven months, right? And I'm hundred percent sure. If you do that, you are going to enter. You are going to enter. You are going to kill it for sure. Okay. Now, if you are thinking, well, uh, since there are almost like two hundred days left, so we should target on six twenty six thirty six hundred like that. Do not do that, my dear students. More the target, more is going to be better. Or better is going to be your rank in the NEET examination. So aim for six eighty plus. If you still, if you are preparing, if you are starting your preparation now. Still, you have to aim for six eighty plus, and that is achievable. That is achievable, right? So, in total, you do not have some ninety six chapters now. There are no ninety six chapters now in your PCB. There are almost almost how many chapters? There are almost seventy five chapters left in your syllabus, right? Almost seventy five chapters left. Now, my dear students, these seventy five chapters you are not going to complete in two hundred days. No, nothing like that. The seventy-five chapters should be completed just in one fifty days. So, if you are starting your preparation now, my dear students, make a calendar, make a routine, make a proper routine in such a way, in such a way that your all the seventy-five chapters should be done and dusted in one fifty days. It looks a huge target, but it's not. Let me tell you that it is not. Yes, students. If seventy-five chapters are to be done in one fifty days, that means one chapter in every subject is to be done in two days. For example, you are starting from chemistry. You are starting from GOC. GOC you have to complete in two days. GOC you have to complete in two days, right? Similarly, mold concept you are complete in two days. You have got two days of time to complete the chapter, and two days it's enough, my dear students. It is enough, my dear students, to complete one chapter in two days. Perfect. It is more than sufficient. It is more than sufficient. You can do it. And how to do a chapter? How to do a chapter? Before that, let me tell you: do not focus on only one subject on a given day. Now the now the time is very. It is it is comparatively less now, right? You are not going to focus on one subject on a given day. You have to prioritize two subjects on a given day: physics, chemistry, day one; chemistry, biology, day two; biology, physics, day three. Like that. Like that, you are going to rotate. But keep one thing in mind: whatever target is in your mind, whatever target you are going to make as per this particular schedule, you have to accomplish that target at any cost, my dear students. At any cost, I'm telling you, do the self study of eight hours. For example, on day one, on day one, let's say you did the self study of eight hours, but you were unable to accomplish your target of day one. That means in day two, in day two, you will be studying for nine or ten hours instead of eight, so that to complete the left out portion of day one as well. So in this way, you are going to continue your study from now onwards, my dear students. So two subjects on a single day, right? This is important. And at the same time, how do you complete the lap? How do you complete the chapter? Basically, there are a lot of students who study, who read one particular chapter, but still they won't get that confidence in them, right? How do we get that confidence? There is one simple process which you have to follow. One simple process you have to follow. What is that process, my dear students? First of all, whatever is your daily target, whatever chapter you have to complete on a given day, you'll be watching its lectures. While watching the lecture, while watching the lecture, make the notes. Make the notes. Right. While watching the lecture, make the notes. After your notes are done, go for the NCERT reading of the same topic whose lecture you have covered. Right, and after your NCERT reading is done, get some more important points from NCERT which you think are important, and type them down, note them down in the notes. Right, after NCERT reading, whatever questions your teacher has done in the lecture, just solve the same questions again, but at this time you are not going to see the solution. Solve the same questions again which your teacher has done, and while while you are watching the lecture, your teacher. What whosoever teacher it is, teachers always in the lectures they show you the standard questions basically, right? They show you the standard questions. My dear students, you are going to try those standard questions again, 
but without seeing the solution. After doing that, after doing that, whatever material you have, be it offline or online, whatever material you have, whatever material, because on every material content nowadays is same, right? But make sure it's a neat oriented material. It's not J oriented material. Do the, solve the study material, whatever material you have. If you are following some book, if you are following some coaching material, right? No issues at all. Whatever topics, whatever topic you have covered in the lecture, do its problem practice. Do its problem practice. After doing the study material, after, after doing the questions of the topic which, you have, which your teacher has done in the lecture, from the study material, after that, go for PYQs. Because from PYQs, you'll get the more idea, you'll get the detailed idea of the important topics from a particular chapter. You'll get the idea by solving the PYQs only. And my dear students, at the end, at the end, once you are done with one chapter, write a mock test. Write a mock test. Whatever the source is, write a mock test. But make sure the mock test is of neat standard. Make sure the mock test is of neat standard. If you follow this particular process, my dear students, let me honestly tell you, let me honestly tell you, you are going to do it. You are going to get that satisfaction. You are going to get that confidence that this chapter is done and dusted, right? And if the question comes from this chapter, you are going to kill it. Trust me on that. Okay? Now, if you really think this is going to be, the process is going to be super difficult for you, right? If you want to be disciplined throughout this preparation, then do not rely only on YouTube. If you think, if you really think you are not going to remain disciplined throughout this particular journey, then I would suggest, my dear students, to join this particular Avenger 3.0 batch which we launched yesterday, right? In this Avengers 3.0 batch, your entire syllabus of physics, chemistry, biology will be done and dusted from the basics, from the scratch. All the theory and problem patterns are included from every particular chapter. Physics, Shreya sir, chemistry, me and HSP sir, biology, Ambika ma'am. Everything is done and dusted by your neat English team, right? The test series is included in this particular batch. Chapter wise mock tests are also included. And my dear students, the best part is, the best part is, in this particular batch, 75% of the syllabus you are getting in recorded format. Once you enter into this batch, you'll be getting 75% of the syllabus in the recorded format, which we have recorded. I have recorded for chemistry. Shreya sir has recorded for physics, right? And similarly, Ambika ma'am, she has recorded for biology. And 25% of the syllabus will be live. And if you think, while watching the recording lecture, you'll be having any sort of doubt, you need not to worry about that as well. No need to worry about that as well. Why? Because, because we will be arranging doubt sessions for you. Right? We will be arranging. We'll have a track on you, basically. We'll have a track on your syllabus, my dear students. Right? And since the batch is launched like yesterday or day before yesterday, so there are only some 200 seats left. And you will be having the excess of this particular batch till your need 2024 examination. So if you have not joined into this particular batch, which is very, very, very affordable, I would suggest every one of you to join this particular batch at this particular point itself and start your preparation now itself because the batch is affordable as well. And high quality content as per the latest NMC guidelines is in this particular Avenger 3.0 batch, which is particularly in English language, right? Let me quickly show you how do we get enrolled into this particular batch. This is your Unacademy Neat English channel. My dear students, over here, you can see this particular session. We are back, which I took like two days back, right? Click on the session, go to its description. In the description, you will find a link. In the description, you will find a link. Go to this particular session, we are back. And in the description, you'll find a link over here. Join now, this particular link. You just have to click on this particular link. And after joining, after clicking on this particular link, you'll be automatically directed to a page like this on which you have to put your number or you can continue with your email ID. And you are just getting this batch only for 3999 after using the code WASSIM10. By using this particular code, by using my code, you are getting additional off in this particular batch. So my dear students, I would suggest every one of you to join in this particular batch. If you really think it is difficult for you guys to remain disciplined, it is difficult for you guys to focus on continuously, then this is going to be the one-stop solution for all. So join in right now, right now, and let's catch up in the sessions of Avengers 3.0. And all those sessions of Avengers 3.0, you'll get on an academy platform after getting enrolled into this particular batch, right? And if you will be having any sort of queries related to this particular batch, do let me know in the comment section of this particular video. I'll be helping you out personally in order to get into this particular batch because it is affordable and trust me, mark my words, this is one stop solution for all. Okay, so with this, I'll be taking a leave. I hope the video was super beneficial for all of you. So I want you guys 
So let me know in the comment section of the video if you really got that spark in you. If you really are feeling motivated now, if you really are feeling confident now, do let me know in the comment section of this particular video. Take care guys. God bless you all. and love you all.